first of all, there's a YouTuber in Spain that I believe his name is Quantum Fracture. And in one of his videos, he comments that scientists know that time did not begin to exist in the standard model or the Big Bang model. Is he correct on this? No, he's quite incorrect. It's um, just uh, universally believed that in the standard model that time and space come into existence at the moment of the initial cosmological singularity. Uh, neither time nor space can be continued through such a singularity. And therefore, it constitutes a boundary point to space and time. Think of a cone that goes back to a point. The point of the cone is a boundary point for that cone. You cannot continue the cone through that point. It is the boundary of the cone and the geometry of space-time on the standard model is that of a cone. Um, and therefore, the initial cosmological singularity represents the boundary of space and time. And you cannot have time before that. Now, the question that is a live question is, is the standard model correct? Um, cosmologists have been engaged in uh, a search for models for decades now to try to subvert the prediction of the standard model of an absolute beginning. And so we've had one model after another proposed attempting to avoid the prediction of an absolute beginning of the standard model. But as Alex Vilenkin has uh, argued in numerous publications, none of these models is successful. We have no uh, tenable model of a universe which is past eternal.